Welcome to Toffee TV. It is the Everton News Daily. Fabian Delph is the latest Everton player to suffer an injury as the preparations for next Sunday's Merseyside derby uh, are underway. Delph suffered a muscle injury in training and is now rated as doubtful for the game against Liverpool at Goodison on the 21st of June. Um, Delph joins Yeri Mina and Andre Gomez as doubt for that game. Uh, Everton have already definitely lost Theo Walcott and Jean-Philippe Cabaman for that game. So some serious injury worries mounting up for Carlo Ancelotti ahead of that Merseyside derby. Uh, hopefully Delph, if he does miss that one, won't be out for too long. I think we're going to need all of our players uh, as, as fit as can be for the remaining nine games. We know that we've already lost Walcott for a month and, and like I say, Cabaman till next year. So... No more injuries, please, as we move forward. Uh, L'Equipe in France today have confirmed that Everton won't be taking up the uh, option to buy Gibral Sidibe. Uh, that's been muted over the last couple of weeks, but uh, a loan deal may still be on the cards. That's what they're, re that's what they're reporting, saying that uh, Monaco will make that decision to basically keep Sidibe off their wage bill. Uh, Everton pay his wages if he comes on loan here again for another year. Um, does go on to say that Everton may just use John Joe Kenny, who is on loan out at Schalke, but uh, Sidibe may still end up at Everton again next season, although apparently Sevilla, Sevilla has shown a real interest in him as well, so we'll see what happens there. Uh, Richarlison has said that he wants to win things with Carlo Ancelotti at Everton. He called Carlo Ancelotti one of the greatest managers of all time said he's loved working with him so far and is learning things all the time and said hopefully we can achieve great things together. Uh, Richarlison then spoke about the last nine games and says hopefully we can win enough games to finish in the European position and play in that trophy next season. He said the lot can be achieved in these last nine games and we have to keep that flame burning. It is their Everton six points currently off a European spot. Um, depending on the outcome of Manchester City's trial um, and appeal, you know, that could, you know, Everton could be closer to that. It could go down to eighth place, the European places, if that ban uh, for Manchester City is upheld. Of course, that then means the fifth place gets into the Champions League. So definitely a lot to play for for Everton. Um, and that's why they could do with no more of these injuries as we try to move forward with that. Uh, and finally, again, Everton have been linked with a loan move for Kurt Zuma, Zuma who spent last season on loan at Everton, did quite well at uh, Everton, unable to purchase him uh, on a permanent basis in the summer, although they wanted to. Um, he's done okay this year, he's played over 20 games for Lampard at Chelsea this season, but has thought to want to move away from Stamford Bridge, Tottenham also credited with an interest in the 25 year old and that's it for the Everton news daily make sure you subscribe give the video a thumbs up and if you want more great videos join us over on patreon see you later